Hello everybody, my name is Alex Drops, and I have a very short video for you today, but I've been fooling around in the latest snapshot, and my favorite thing added was the at e selector. This is essentially a normal selector, but it works on mobs, such as a pig, as well as other entities. And the important part of this is, is that I can apply this to previous commands, and we can make some really cool stuff. And so I've applied the at e to a uh, spread players command and I created a very simple randomizer so let's give this a try as you'll see when I press the button it will give off a random 1 through 9 number and it will do so by teleporting the pig to a random platform and it will activate a command block So this is really cool for a few reasons. First of all, it's literally two commands. It's extremely simple. And then I have, of course, my outputs down here. But the main reason it's cool is because it is 100% reliable, and we have never seen a really, really good reliable randomizer prior to this snapshot. They've all relied on weird mechanics and things that you generally don't want to use if you want to have 100% reliability. And so let's go and look on how this works. It's very simple. I simply have a spread players command. It's working on an entity, a pig. And I included a radius command in here because, of course, he's within five blocks. So I only want to teleport him. And the 10 and the 0, the negative 10 and the 0, they are just my center point of this platform here. And so for spread players, you want to set the center point. And then the 1 and the 2, this is basically my max radius. The two would be, he can teleport two blocks from this center block. So I guess he could teleport off, but he will go to a solid block, so he won't teleport here. And now the second part of this command, I'm just teleporting the pig to negative 10, 51, 5, which is within this little cage. I should probably also have a radius command here. If I was in a real world, I probably would. And so that's essentially all there is to the simple system. Um, I also do want to point out that you can, of course, make this more or less numbers. So if I want to make this 5 by 5 I could have a total of 25 random numbers. And of course I could make it smaller if I wanted. And it's very flexible and very simple. So I'm sure many of you can figure it out. If you have any questions, go ahead and post them below and I'll try to answer them. I can also try to explain this command better if you don't understand any parts of it. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time.